Yeah. <laughs> one, of the great, one of the greatest, greatest movies he of all time. <laughs> And we are back. It is season three, episode one of The Whistle with Pollock and Hart. My brothers. Season three, episode one. This is season three? Season yeah. three, man. Oh, I need a new contract. <laughs> I know, right? I need a new contract. I need, hey, I need me a, con I need a contract. <laughs> I, hey, we want to start with one first. We want to start with one contract. If we can, first, if we can right. start with one first, you know. Yeah, couple of dollars, maybe take out my trash or something, right. clean around right. a little bit. I'll That's start right. small. That's right. I, we do it for the people. Absolutely. We do it for the football fans, the Buff fans especially. Yep. And well, you know, the coaches, the people were good to us last year. We, we got a lot of stuff shipped in. We oh, didn't we have a contract. Did, you know what? Yes. Hey, listen, I want to talk about that. Listen, we, we send us your stuff like you did for winter and you did during the summer, and we are going to uh, try it out. Absolutely. And we're going to market it on here, and we're going to give our opinion. Like, I still, oh, I probably shouldn't do that. But, you know, it snow again. Oh, hey, listen. And I tried my. I did. My, I did. I, I, I just used that on my truck. You did. The, the, it the, works. The, man. It works great. Let me and a little Preston de-icer. Oh. That's, that's the clutch. Let me tell you that's something. That's the clutch. Let me tell you something, Pilot. Yes. Now, before I went out on my date, I had the. the the, the, the windshield blanket. Yeah. And I'm a, I, when we come back for our next episode, I will have the name of it, and I'll say it again because I can't remember, but it was great. I came out there, folks were scraping off the snow and ice, and I just pulled that thing off like I was a vet. That's right. I was a vet. Like I I've lived there my whole life. I looked professional. <laughs> I was a pro. You understand? Pro Coloradan. Yeah, pro, pro Coloradan. That's right. Well, well, did you happen to see the two non-pros, Prime and Neely? We did. Yeah, it was pretty bad. Oh. We we did see that. I saw. I, I knew that y'all were rookies when you were, when you were out there with your hand. Yeah. And about the third or fourth swipe, I said, "Their hands freezing." Freezing. <laughs> Dumb. You see, you didn't get a fourth or fifth swipe. That's right. Yeah, it was a, a delay of game. Yeah. yeah. Well, should we give them the whistle now? We don't have a. We don't have our whistle. We don't have. But hey, that is definitely was a perfect personal foul. Definitely wait, personal. Wait, foul. Wait, now let me share something with Coach Prime. <laughs> if you look into the details of the video. Mm. When we're cleaning off the windshield, you'll notice some of that 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 snow and ice was was blue like a snow cone. Uh oh. He tried to use the wiper fluid. What? <laughs> he didn't have a degree because that's what I was going to tell you. The second part. Oh man. The second part, Coach. I went out to get something to eat. Right. Met a couple people. It started snowing again. Yeah. It was all farther, but I had I didn't have my blanket on. I had, you know I had right. put it up. That's so right. I thought it was through snowing. Yep. So I had to de. The de the, the greaser, de yeah. the deicer yeah. in the windshield mm. uh, stuff. Man, I hit that thing. It took about, I don't know, maybe 15, 20 seconds at most, I would believe. And that stuff gone. just melted right up it's off gone. of there, and I was rolling. Baby. Gone. Pro. Pros. Pros. I'm, I, I'm a Colorado. pro dealing with the snow now. No. Colorado. Listen, we, I can we, drive we, we, better we, than anybody out here in the snow now. Shoot, I feel, I feel like I'm at home. You know? I tell you what, though, I still got to get used to these right turns here. Because in Texas, folks don't walk like y'all walk around here. <laughs> oh, yeah. Or ride these electric that, bikes that and stuff is like sure. that. And, you know, I, I'm just saying, Pollock, I think I've hit or almost hit maybe two or three <laughs> people a day. Hey, listen. A day. I say it all the time, folks. Listen, I understand you have the right of way. And I, I don't, understand, I don't understand. That what you're thinking. But you're going to lose that battle. I don't know what you're thinking. You're going to lose that battle if you get hit. Because so I drive a shit. Look up from your little phone, look left, look right, look back left, yeah. and then walk across. Yeah. Don't make, just assume yeah, that everybody sure sees see you. you. Yeah, 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 exactly. Yeah. You know? Heavy Chevy over here. Yeah. yeah. Lead yeah. foot. Yeah. And speaking of, I got me got me new truck out here. Got me a new, I seen it, too. Got, yeah, I got me a new GMC. Oh, that thing pretty, y'all. Y'all yeah. got to see it. Y'all got to come out and see us, got, man. Come got, see Pilot's and, truck. Uh, and uh, so, yeah, I'm, I'm feeling pretty good yeah. driving around out here. Let me... I'm excited. <laughs> I, I gotta climb up in it, but I'm, I'm excited. Listen, guys, I gotta do a confession too, okay? Because this was not Coach Polly. This was not Coach Neely. Yes, yes, yes. It was your man, Hart, Andre Hart. I decided, because we were getting into the season and things were going a little left, to postpone the whistle. Yes, I did. Coach Pollock, Coach Neely loved you. They wanted to keep going, but I figured if we were going to give a good show, we had to be winning. So this is what I want y'all to do. I want y'all to tell us right now. 
Win or lose, do you want to hear from the whistle? Hey, that's a great question, Coach. Hey, and you know what? I talked to Coach Hart about it. He had some really good points. Um, you know, he, he didn't want it to make it look like we were focused so much on the whistle as focusing on what we got to take care of business and everything. Yeah. That's right. So uh, that was part of, part of it. But, uh, yeah, we want to hear. Yeah. Um, do y'all want to hear from us after we, you know, don't do as well as we, you know, want to do on a Saturday maybe. But, you know, we hope this next year we don't have that. Problem. I like how my guy, my guy said maybe now because yeah, we, we, right. we, we out here. Because, I mean, we plan it on taking care of business. That's right. We taking do. care of business. And we have so much fun. No doubt. And so I didn't no want to have fun and, you know. That's right. You know, Absolutely. What happened, happened. Well, you speak, know. speaking so. of speaking of coming up short, Coach, we got we to gotta talk about our boys. Uh, y'all don't know this. Y'all may know this. Yeah. Coach Hart and I are big Dallas Cowboys fans. We are. And y'all are not alone. Uh, you know, yeah. Okay, uh, see that? Neely too. See that? We love the boys. Now, we are football fans first. Yes. I will say that. Yes. So what we about to do, but understand we are Cowboy fans. Yes, okay. we are Cowboy fans. All right, go ahead. Go and uh, I'm, 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 I'm very disappointed in their performance in very. the playoffs. Very. Uh, as a matter of fact, I was disappointed in their performance at the end of the season because they could have had the number one seed mm -hmm. and had a first round bye, but they didn't take care of business. And, uh, you know, Coach, uh, Dan Quinn's got a job with the Commanders. He so, does. So they, I heard they're that. trying to bring in a new DC. I heard that. But man, hey, boys, listen. Y'all got to help us out. Y'all got to help us out. Because, man, I, I'm going to tell you right now, I, I, it, it, it was bad. It was bad, and I was, and I thought it had passed. I really thought it all passed. Everybody made fun of us on Facebook and social media, and got their little shots in. And then the Chiefs made the playoffs, and, some, and somebody had to post that Taylor Swift has been to more Super Bowls than the Cowboys this Ooh. century. And I'm gonna tell you, <laughs> the Swift that hurt my heart. <laughs> hey, I love Taylor Swift. The truth does hurt me. I love it. My daughters love her. I love this whole my thing. My daughter loves it. My kids yeah, love it. I love this whole. Listen, I'm gonna tell you something. I listened to Stephen A. Smith the other day talk about he went to took his daughter to the concert. That's right. Listen, I went to the concert. She came here in Denver. Y'all, let me go and tell you. Girl puts on a show now. She puts on a she show. She went at it for three and a half hours, hard. Yeah. Didn't he take it? Take any breaks? Was playing. I mean. She played more instruments than I even knew they was Look, existed. Mr. And Kelsey, it's, it's sixty-five Mr. trucks. Mr. Kelsey, yes, you you tools. have outkicked your coverage. Hey, and let me tell you something, boys. Uh, Learn something from Mr. Kelsey. Please shoot your shot immediately. Don't be scared. Hey, if she turns you down, that's fine. But hey, our boy uh, Killer Trav, he shot his shot, man. And I you see, and you I, see how it's working out. And I don't think he paid for no dinner dates. No. I mean, she, no. she just no. making him money left and right. That, that and just, her, her, I mean, her check is much bigger than he oh, he got a no doubt. Ain't Ain't no doubt. I get no to doubt. keep my money. And listen, I, 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 I personally, from a football stand, uh, stand, uh, fan standpoint, I think it's a good thing. You know, of course, you know, we being Cowboys fans, we used to good-looking women come to games. I mean, when Tony Romo was – they can carry Underwood and Justin yeah. Simpson. They were showing them all the time. It was. You know? It was. And nobody yeah. was complaining. Yeah, we were still so, in the same boat. We put yeah, out the first round. Still the same boat. Kind of stuff but, like you know, that, man, I I, so we used, we used to that. Swifties, y'all think y'all can help us? I, yeah. Y'all, what's hey, that? Hey. Maybe not. Hey, she, she's with Travis Kelsey. Yeah, she with Travis. But you know what? You know, could be better than a tight end as a quarterback now. I mean, that's a franchise. That's a franchise deal right this there. This is a whole nother level. That's right. Swifties, listen to that's me. Right. Now. That's a talk, whole nother talk level. Talk to us now. Talk to him. Talk to him. I want you to think Come about on now. this now. Come on. Okay. Now. Upgrade yourself, right? Yeah. Like That's right. It's cool. You that's know, right. It's cool to be with the tight end. It's cool. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Kills, I like it. But listen, hey, we talking about franchise. Right. Yeah. Face yeah. of the team. America's team. America, um, America's, America's team. team. America's sweetheart. America's team. Swifties. That's yeah. right. She could be the first lady of America's team. Yeah, come on now. The first lady. I know y'all like that. Come on now. I know y'all do. So anyway, I I just want to shout out that I'm all for Taylor being at the games. I'm all for the recognition it, it brings to the NFL. Uh, hand it to the NFL for <laughs> bringing brilliant marketing. Oh, it was great. <laughs> I man. mean, I can't. Brilliant mark. Hey, they got Roger Goodell up there. Hey man, show her again. Yeah. <laughs> you know? Yeah. He knows what's up. He knows what's you up, know? man. Yeah. And uh, you know, like I say. I, you know, I raised my daughters right, so they already love football, mm. and they love the Cowboys. And mm. and uh, my oldest daughter, she's a Chiefs fan too, because her boyfriend's a Chiefs fan. But but uh, she, they they are just eating this up. Well, they are were, eating this up. And uh, I think the more women 
and people it brings to our great game to help our great game grow. I'm it all for it. I'm all for anything that uh, that, that, that that would do that. Where you watching the game, man, Polly? Uh, well, you know what, Uncle Neil? Yeah. Where you watching the game, man? You? You know, um, I'm gonna be watching the game in Jackson, Mississippi. Oh, I'm, I'm going home not, for Super Bowl weekend. That's all right. That's, yeah. I I think I'm gonna stay right here in Colorado. Yep. I've been on the road, Coloradians. You, yeah. You I've been on the road been. the last three weeks. Yep. And we've been hitting it hard, finding quality, good players for you guys to cheer at. Because you know you're going to cheer. And you cheer that's early. Right. You get there real early. That's right. I love that. Don't you love Absolutely, that? Absolutely, Coach. Absolutely. So that's what we've been doing. So I'm kind of tired of the planes yes. and stuff. So I might be right here. Coach, where are you going to be? I'm, I'm going to be right here, Coach. I, I've, I've been out of town myself, too, a little bit. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, I've, I've uh, I got to just chill here at the house this weekend. Yeah. I'm going to enjoy the game. Uh, we, we may have a few folks over at the house to watch the game That's all right. and uh, enjoy ourselves and uh, just, just just take it all in. But I'm, I'm with you, man. I, I've been on too many planes here lately, yeah. and I just need to chill and, and relax and and, uh, and kind of get my mojo back. You know, what I like to talk about as a you know most people don't like watching the games with me because I watch it as a coach. Yeah. Like I would sit there, they shouldn't create a DVR and you can rewind the TV live action because I will rewind a play and rewind That's a play right. and look at technique. Footwork Absolutely. and how things are. You know what else? When I go to the game, I don't sit on the 50-yard line sideways view. I like to get that end zone view. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. View. The, be the best seat in the house is the second level Ta end zone. Mm -hmm. Second level, second end, level zone. end zone. If you've never listened to the coaches here at the Whistle now, and Uncle Neil, y'all listen to it. Absolutely. Get you a ticket. That's I right. promise you. If you sit on the sideline, get you a ticket. Second level, coach. Second level. Second level. Second level. Mezzanine level. Mezz mezzanine. Okay. <laughs> Italian, French. Something like Something that. Something like that. It one of them. <laughs> and you get right there, and you sit down. You can see the alignments, the yes. leverage of the gaps, what coverage they rolling down to. Absolutely. I mean, you start calling the game, people move away from you because mm -hmm. I call right. it out before it happens. That's right. That's how good That's, we are. Uh, absolutely. Yeah, all right. Well, well, coach, you're speaking of calling out before it happens. This is a Super Bowl episode. Season three, episode one. Season we got to get predictions. Oh, we do. Man. We do. I I go first. Go ahead, coach. I'm going with the swiftest. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> That's baby. who I'm going with. Hey, I'm going I'm... with my homeboy, the swifties. <laughs> hey, I we going with late. Kelsey. I'm telling you right I'm now. Many dates. You, you you can't you can't you can't do nothing. And 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 listen, let's face it. I'm a Cowboys fan. I can't go for the Niners. I just can't it's do it, man. It's hard for me to go for the Niners, it's too. It's hard for me to go for like, the Niners. I, I, I am impressed with Purdy, though. I do like, like when Purdy. They, like, and I like, I like CMC, too. I do. I like CMC, and yeah. I like Debo. Yeah. So I like, I like what I do they like got going now. on. I do. But, you know. I'm and you can't get to Purdy. Purdy gets that ball out. Yes, I don't know if y'all been watching. You blitz Purdy, that ball is not going to be there. That's right. When you get there. He has done an excellent job of that, and it's a good reason why they're in the Super Bowl. But I'm telling you right now. I bet you, Coach, speaking of that, get that ball out. I bet you Purdy has drawn more roughing the quarterbacks because the ball is gone than anybody this season. I, I would, I don't, I would agree. With like you he on milks that, that call. That's he right. does. That's I right. would agree with you on that. It's the, well, I guess it's not like basketball. I was gonna say it's the best flop in football. <laughs> no, he ain't flopping. <laughs> he can, he ain't flopping because he get yeah. hit. That's right. He get hit. Get, he get touched. He get hit. He get right. touched. And see, they, I think sometimes you know defensive players, they 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 also kind of know who the quarterback is. They chase. Cause yeah. like if, they, if it if you know when Brady was back there, you could tell they pull up on him because they know if they even touched him, what was gonna happen? That's right. Mahomes is saying, well, they, you know, I think they pull up on Mahomes a little bit. I think they still not at that that point with Purdy where they they respect him enough to to pull up, pull up on him. So they trying to they're test trying his metal. That's right. They yeah. testing mm -hmm. him out a little mm -hmm. bit. See, he got salt to him. I agree know. with that hundred percent. I him. agree hundred percent. But yeah, that. you know, I'm 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 thinking the Chiefs are gonna pull it out. And uh, you know, but it, but regardless, I think it's going to be a great game. I think it we got a great, great matchup. I think we got a great game coming forward Sunday. I, you know, I'm I'm going with the. Uh, I'm, I'm on. I, you know, I can't I can't bet. But anybody that has asked me about you know the bet to take, because they always want to know what I would bet. I've just told them take the over on Taylor Swift sightings. Swifties. <laughs> take the over on Taylor Swift. Sightings. On the Swifties. <laughs> That's they the best be prop bet. That's the best thing I can give you. I guarantee they got four sessions already. <laughs> Just with the fans. Ain't no they doubt. don't know what's going on in the game. Ain't no None doubt. of that. They got the 87 jerseys Ain't. on. Yes, sir. And they just they just wait yes, to see her on this screen. Sir. When she hit the screen, it's going to erupt. Yes, sir. Well, speaking of erupt, season three, episode one has erupted. And uh, everybody have a great Super season Bowl. You heard three. the predictions. 
And we'll be That's back right. next week, man, with another episode of Wilson. It'll be season three, episode two, Coach Hart. Wow. Season three, episode two coming up. Wow. Is my pension started yet for this show? Did we get the time? <laughs> I think I've earned it, right? 401k. 401k, right? Is it? Is it no, Kicking not, in. Not, not, Kicking not, in. Not, not, no, Come on, not. YouTube. Let's go. Come on, YouTube. Yeah, you just subscribe, <laughs> all that. Hit that subscribe. Know. Hit the bell. Hit the bell. Hit the, whatever. The, the, whatever you got to hit. Just say cha-ching <laughs> over here. That's what we want to do. That's what we need. God bless you.